hi welcome to my channel again today we are going to see how to install and configure Zimra mail server the Zimra collaboration community edition on Oracle Linux 8 here this is our server topology we have a standalone server with public IP assigned and connected to internet we want to configure the server as our mail server so that our client can communicate with the server and send receive mail through the server today we will install Zimra on this system so let's get started First, we need to configure our DNS. We need to set up our domain's MX record so that other mail server on the internet can find our server to send mail to our domain. I have purchased my domain from GoDaddy. So we need to configure GoDaddy DNS. Let's go to the DNS configuration. Here I have logged into my GoDaddy account. This is the domain manager and DNS management. We can manage our DNS from here. Let's create the A record first. Our IP is 58. This is our server IP. Click save. Now create the MX record for the domain and the mail server FQDN is mailer.mailserverguru.com. Priority let's say 10. Click save. Now let's check our records are resolvable from the internet. Let's check the MX record mailserverguru.com so it finds the mailer.mailserverguru.com this is the responsible server for this domain so our DNS configuration is okay now let's log into our server and install Zimra here I am logged into my server check the hostname hostname is mailer and the FQDN is mailer.mailserverguru.com now let's check the MX record from the system MST MX so it shows mailserverguru.com's mail is handled by mailer.mailserverguru.com this server and if we check our operating system version this is Oracle Linux Server 8 8.2 and I have downloaded the latest GCS 8.8.15 this package is for Red Hat Linux based operating system like CentOS, Red Hat, Oracle Linux let's enter the package before that we need to install the Perl packages Okay, so our Perl module installation is okay. Now let's go to the GCS folder and run the installed SH. Do you agree with the term of the software license? Yes. Use Zimra package repository? Yes. Configuring package repository. Select the packages to install. Zimra LDAP, yes. Logger, MTA, DNS cache, SNMP, store, Apache, spell, memcache, proxy, drive, Zimra IMFD. This is the beta and not recommended to install. Okay, leave it like this. Zimra chat, yes. The system will be modified. Continue, yes. Beginning installation. and it determining which package to install and which package to download downloading packages it will download 11 packages Zimbra proxy component it will take some time Installing local packages, 26 packages it will install. Now installing extra 5 packages. 
now running the post installation configuration dns error resolving mx for mailer.mailservergroup.com so it is trying to resolve the whole fqdn but it should resolve only the domain part so let's copy the domain part change domain name yes we need to put the domain portion only choose option 7 then 4 to set the password now R for the previous menu and A for apply save configuration data to a file of course save config file okay the system will be modified continue yes now setting local config values it will set a lot of value to the various configuration files so it will take some time now it's creating SSL creating SSL for various services installing mailbox DSSL certificate installing the initializing LDAP installing LDAP SSL setting nginx password lots of configuration option is saving to various configuration files now installation is okay now it's starting the servers now it's installing the common zimlets creating the global address list sync account for default domain now it says the notify zimbra of your installation not necessary Now the installation is okay. This is the final log file. Configuration complete. Press return to exit. Now if we check the services are running. All services are running. Now let's go to the web browser and log into the Zimbra admin panel. Our services are running and this is the Zimbra version click manage let's create a user Munna at Guru. password now click finish now let's open the webmail and also let's run the mail log now let's send a mail from gmail i am now in my gmail account let's send a mail to una at mailserverguru.com subject system check click send let's see the log file if the setup is okay then it should receive mail from gmail here it's connect from the outside from munnavai at gmail.com to munna at mailsabaguru.com and it checked by the filter amavis and it receives the mail and status sent and delivery okay if we check from the webmail 
the system check from munawaya at gmail.com now if we reply back to this mail send if we see the log from munna at mail server guru to munnawai at gmail.com and it delivered to google's mail now if we check from the internet system check system check received so our mail send receive is 100 percent okay so we have successfully installed and configured zimra on oracle linux 8 so this is it for today thank you for being with me if you still didn't subscribe to my channel please subscribe it will encourage me to create more videos for you so thank you i'll see you on the next video bye